hey guys so i'm back and today i am doing me a seafood boil so i have my oven already on for 100 degrees and basically i have my smoked sausage i have my shrimp my corn my crab and my red potatoes and this is everything i'm going to season my stuff with as you guys can see so let's get right in i'm gonna take you over to the sink because i got to wash the food make sure y'all position right so y'all can see what i'm doing boom there you go so i'm finna turn on the water I got my bowl and I'm basically going to wash the shrimp. Get that in. I think I'm going to keep the shell on because it holds flavor. Basically, I'm washing the shrimp, and it's only just me, so I am about to clean the crab legs. I didn't get snow crab legs, so I got regular crab legs. Them out and clean those as well. That's done. I'm going to get another bowl for my corn. As you can see, I got my corn right here. I'm going to peel him off. And I'm going to cut this up right along with the potatoes. bowl for the corn and then I'm going in with my red potatoes and clean those off okay this out the way so bring y'all guys over here make sure y'all position right yep so now I'm going to get my cutting board out, rinse that off. And what I'm about to do is cut up my corn and my potatoes. Just cut the tip off. Just three pieces. And I'm going to cut up my potatoes. Sliced potatoes. I like a lot of potatoes in my um, crab bowl. I should have got some um, some crawfish would have been good. So yeah, my potatoes is being cut. Just like that. And I'm going to go ahead on and season them a little bit. So I'm going to add some seasonal, some nature seasoning. Because it already got black pepper and everything else in it. And I'm going to add some onion powder. Set that to the side. So to this... Didn't mean to open that up. Turn y'all around. And basically what I'm going to do is take out the butter. Move that out the way. And just sprinkle a little obey in here. Just like that. And 
in add some butter I've been getting a lot of happy birthday wishes. And add the butter in. I love butter. So, uh -uh. so it's nothing wrong with butter. Butter make everything taste good. So we got that going. So what I'm gonna do now is get my smoked sausage ready. And I'm going to uh, cut that up. And I'm going to rinse it off. Set that to the side. I'm going to cut these in the slant. Ready? Meg, get you. <laughs> there you go. So now what we're about to do is we're about to do the sauce. So I'm about to turn my oven on, stove on rather, and let it heat up. And I'm going to add some butter to it. And I have my um, crab boil oil too as well. So make sure y'all position so y'all can see. So I'm going in with some unsalted butter. And I want it to be have a lot of butter. And I also have my lemon that I'm finna roll out. So as you guys can see, I want y'all to, the butter is melting down. going so now I'm about to cut my lemon I'm gonna roll it out release the juices and cut the lemon that to the side So to this, I'm going to add my nature seasoning. Not too much. And just some lemon pepper to help. Just a little. Okay. And I'm adding in some onion powder. And some garlic powder. And also, I'm going to add in my minced garlic. Minced garlic going in. I just like a lot of garlic. <laughs> my heat down. I'm going to add a little bit more butter. And then I'm going in with my Obey seasoning. I'm 
Let me get my wooden spoon. Get my wooden spoon so I'm just sitting up here scraping metal. I'm gonna reduce the heat down some. I want a little bit more. Oh, there we go. Now I'm gonna add my um, crab oil oil, just like a cap full. And then I'm going to squeeze in my lemon. Drop the lemon in there. And there you go. And it smells real good. So now I got it the consistency that I wanted. I'm going to cut it off. And bring you guys over here. So now what I'm about to do is get my foil out and I'm going to make like a bowl kind of like. So make sure you guys can see. right here because this is what's going to help me um, form it up better. So I'm going to push the aluminum foil down into this bowl. Just like that. So. Make sure y'all position correct. So I'm going to open this up and that way y'all can see what I'm going in with. So now I'm going in with my uh, corn and potatoes and my sausage. Don't worry, it's going to fit. I'm going to make it fit. <laughs> and I'm going to throw in my shrimp. And then I'm going to lay these in correctly. I want all my butter. All my butter. Just fold them legs up like that and lay it in. See? Now we're going in with the sauce. All of it in there. And I'm going to leave the lemon. Uh -oh. I'm going to leave the lemon in there just to give it that uh, lemon flavor. And now I'm going to add a little bit of season oil, just a little. And I'm going to add my obey. Some more obey. Mm -hmm. 
and a little cap for a little bit more crab or boil or and I just love garlic so that's just me cuz garlic helps with my uh, blood pressure so basically here we go now if you want to because that's how it look just to be on the safe side because I'm going to add just a tablespoon more butter just to make sure that my um, potatoes get some butter on it. Just a look. So I'm going to go ahead on and fold this up. And I'm going to get a pan. I am going to add some more foil on top too. So don't worry. So I'm going to use my um, cookie sheet. Well, not my cookie sheet, but my cake pan. And I'm going to put the foil on top. I'm only going to slit a hole in at the top just a little. Just a little so I can breathe out. So, you guys about to follow me to the oven. Turn my light on. And I'm going to drop my rack. So as I can find me an oven mitt. There we go. Drop my rack down. Row. And here we go. I'm putting my crab boil in. So I'm going to let this cook for I want to say about a good 45 to 50 minutes. Just enough for the potatoes to steam. That's why I cut the hole at the top so I can release the steam out so the potatoes can steam too, right along with the um the vegetables. So I'm going to clean up and I'll be right back with you guys for the end result so y'all can see everything. Thank you for joining me and this time I'm not going to forget to record so y'all can see the end results and I appreciate y'all taking the time and watching my videos. Like, subscribe and thank you guys for watching. I hope y'all enjoy. Bye bye.